Hi, hello brothers and sisters. It's me, Aziz, again and again. Um, this time, I'm going to surprise you guys. It is really a surprise. Um, a lot of my friends that they don't know I am a writer. I write poems, you know. I wrote a lot about, you know, a lot, a lot about a lot of different things. And, you know, I just write according to according to what I feel. I mean, uh, I just write according to the situation. How it affected me, whether it's positive or negative. So, you can say I am not that really good writer, but I wrote a lot of things. And uh, today I have something wonderful for you guys, for all of you. I want you to listen, and you just may understand it, or you may like it or not. But I just want to share it with my folks around the world. And guys, uh, I, I just like writing sometimes. Okay, so I wrote a lot about uh, uh, different things, romantic things, um, sad things, happy things, a lot of different things. Well, but today, I want you to listen. By the way, I, I post this, uh, uh, this poem lyrics, I post them on my Facebook, guys. But I just want to make it as a video to, to hear it with my tone of voice, to, to you know, to hear it the way I want to perform it. You know, you, you, you may do it different, but you, I want you to listen to my performance. Right. And the title is, the title of the poem is The World Crisis. A lot of people, guys, wrote about the world crisis. But this is my own thing. This is my own different expression. The world crisis. The world crisis, we used to have Al-Qaeda and now there is ISIS. We used to have Al-Qaeda and now there is ISIS. Blood everywhere. Blood everywhere whenever sunset arises. Blood everywhere whenever sunset arises. We need someone strong and wise. We need someone strong and wise. We need to stop ISIS forcing the world accept Islam, otherwise everybody dies. We need to stop ISIS forcing the world to accept Islam, otherwise everybody dies. Look at the world size. Brothers and sisters, look at the world size and it will start to minimize. Victims everywhere. And everybody sees himself wise. Victims everywhere. And everyone sees himself wise. We need strong leaders to make us rise. We need strong leaders to make us rise. Let's cooperate in instruction instead of destruction. But unfortunately, no reaction. Children crying and dying. Children crying and dying and we don't want to even apologize. We don't want to apologize, guys. Look at the wall. Nobody really want to be told. Look at the wall. Nobody want to be told. The leaders say it is not their fault. Please, God. Please, Allah, heal the world. God, heal the world. You are the one never, never needs to be told. Victims of children's orphans dream of a better world. The question is, who this fault? Who this fault, guys? No answer. Politicians only using pencils and board. And guys, I want you to think big. I don't mean pencils like someone holding a pencil and I mean that politicians only doing things on tables, but on the ground, yeah, think like that. So that's why I use this one. And instead of saying directly, I say, politicians only using pencils and board. To the peace, 
we made no step and no effort. People just want to make it short and blame the national court. People just want to make it short and blame the national court. Look at the division. Divisions. Divisions everywhere. Divisions available. Divisions available everywhere. Civilian, Libyan, Syrian, and rebellion. And there are more than million. And I'm afraid this number is going to be billion. God, please help everybody. God, please help everybody, whether it's Yemenis or Palestinian. The enemy of the world does not care whether you are Sudanese or Kenyan. The enemy of the world will never differentiate whether you are Sudanese or Kenyan. Guys, let's open our eyes. Guys, let's wake up and open our eyes. The world crisis broke my heart twice. People prefer the word violence instead of being kind and nice. Yes, brothers and sisters, people prefer the word, the word violence instead of being kind and nice. At the end of the day, everybody gonna pay the price. We got bitten by the snake twice. We got bitten by the snake twice. After a long time wondering, I wrote the world crisis. Let's, let's be more vigilant. Let's be more vigilant and wise. I am done. And this is my last advice. The only way out, the only way out is to pray and cry and apologize to Allah, not to someone, to Allah. The only way out to pray and cry and apologize, God, we need your mercy. We need your mercy, even though we are not grateful for our brains and eyes. Thank you very much. This is the world crisis and this is the poem that I, I just wrote. You know, you may look at it very simple. You may say, well, it's, uh, yeah, it's a kind of word that you just, a couple of words, just combine them together and that's it. But like, you know, I feel like when I did it, I feel like, yes, I expressed something. It was like bothering me. Guys, I'm dying every day. I'm dying of what's happening. And everybody who has a heart can feel the same. So I wrote this just expressing myself. And I think if everybody, everybody does, everything will be amazing. Thank you very much. And again, I'll say adios.